everybody, Blue the Prairie Dog here, your host with the most. And we're back to Let's Play Chocobo's Racing. Alright, in this episode, we'll hopefully win another race and, yeah, get closer to the uh, end of the game. Chapter 4, The Pleasure is Mine. <laughs> well, now Chocobo, Mog, and Golem continued on their journey. They soon moseyed on to an old abandoned mine. It sure was one lonesome looking place. Quee! These are the Mithril Mountains. People used to mine a kind of metal called Mithril here. But since the Mithril supply ran out, they gave up digging. Be careful. Me hear bandits here. Bandits? You've got to be kidding me. We've got to go through the mines to get the other side. Of the mountains, you know. Don't nobody move. <coughs> Wait, I need to pick out. <coughs> hello, hello. What are nice kids like you doing in a place like this? You better end over your pennies and pence if you want to stay alive, mates. Hey, hey, hey! You guys do what he says. My life, your leader's life, is at stake. Quee! Hey, you have blue crystal too? What? Huh? What? A surprise this is. You saying you have them too? This makes it interesting then. I dare you to race me in my mines. The losers have to give I've gotta give up their blue crystals, right? Quee Okay, we no lose. Fine, we'll race, so cut it out and let me go already. You look like you've got it what it takes. But there be magic stones of ice in this air place. One stone lets you cast blizzard. It places a sheet of ice on the course that makes whoever runs over it spin out of control. This is where Mog's ability flap comes in. Using two stones cast blizzard. Which makes lots and lots of ice for others to spin out on. Three stones cast blizzard. Blizzaga. That freezes all your foes in ice and makes them crash. Not that any of this matters, because even if you were to pick up an ice stone, I'll use my ability mug to steal it from yours. Alright, let's race this go 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 bleh, goblin. Goblin, that's his name. Gobs. <laughs> now, I would use flap, but dash is... A lot more valuable, so yeah. Grip doesn't really do anything, I don't think. Even though it says it does something, it just. Yeah. <laughs> Two, one, go! So while we're doing this, how about I talk about something awesome, eh, guys? Okay, so here's the deal. Uh, it's around Christmas time right now. Ha ha ha. Shortcut. Ha <laughs> ha. So, yeah, I was just wondering what are you guys doing for the holidays? Um, I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna. No! Ah, uh, I slipped on my own. No! Catching up ain't easy. Hua! But that is. Haha! <laughs> um, yeah. 
So I figure my next LP after this one, I'm not really sure, but I'm hoping to get some, either a new laptop or some better video filming and editing programs so that way I can make my let's plays a little more appealing. I don't know, what do you think? Is this still okay with normal format and everything? We won. We won. Way too easy. Though the difficulty did get ramped up. Ha! Huh, we sure showed you! Koa, blimey, what have I done? I was being too easy on yous. Yeah, yeah. Let's have the blue crystal out of your earring there. Maybe. Quee. What's up, Chalk? Hey, what's this? Yikes, that be me. Let's see. Your royal highness. I shall be stealing your beloved treasure, your most faithful subject, Goblin Hood, Triple X. Goblin Hood? You don't mean THE Goblin Hood. Me hear Goblin Hood before. He steal from Brad, rich only. He give to good, poor. So you're the big hero, or should I say hero, then? Hobbs knobs to goblins. Now you know who I is. Well, I ain't gonna run or hide. What you gonna do? Give me away to the cops or something? Hey, yeah. We could get a big reward for snitching on this guy. Quee quee. What are you queeing for? Are you saying don't do it? Me can tell too. He not bad goblin. Quee. Uh, <laughs> ha! What bunch of softies uses? Ah, oh, gee, we could have become filthy rich from the reward money. Quee! All right, all right. I won't snitch on him, no matter how much he deserves it. Okay, let us through, Goblin Hood. Uh-uh. Sorry, Dory. I'm afraid not, chums. What now? I'm afraid you'll have to let me come with you. I can't just let you go knowing who I is and all. Quee quee. What's worse, you seem to have to have too good a nose for sniffing out people's treasures there, mate. Takes one to know one. Wow, this could work. Hang on a sec, don't get me wrong. I ain't gonna steal anything for you, red nose. Hey, I'm no thief. I just got a knack for sniffing out treasure, and don't call me Red Nose, Big Ears. Well, anyways, it must be destiny that we met. I'm looking forward to working with you, mate. This has got to be my unlucky day. Quee! <laughs> Golem in the background just comes out of nowhere. Whee! <laughs> so once again, another fella joined our party. What awaits our pals on the other side of the mine? That was awesome. So, next episode, uh, another racer comes onto the scene. More magic stones. Another race. Yep. Until then, until then. <laughs>